Jackie Singh, the Indian wonder, the hacker, but legal, Ms. But Legal, she has gone on a tirade. She says, hey, ex Josh, question. How is it that your father and grandfather have had good careers and merited service to our nation? Well, nobody in my family has served the nation of, of India, but uh, yeah, you decided to become an internet, capital I, internet. Congratulations, Jackie. Good job, Jackie. It is a proper noun. Good job. Become an internet lowlife and start Kiwi Farms. I can see why you'd be angry about your mother. She looks like a train wreck. She takes pics with her other kids like she did with you, and now from outside, it looks like you don't even exist. That would do a number on any kid. Her entire situation, plus your father disowning you, seems to explain you, but still doesn't excuse you. Um, now... You guys have listened to me talk quite a bit, and I have spared little details about my family over the years, uh, which is probably unwise. But I think everyone who knows anything about me knows that this is all bullshit. <laughs> I don't know how you can fail dox my my family, considering that they've been successfully doxed like a thousand times by like the, a bunch of angry retards uh, who post about them on various websites all over the internet to try and get back at me for some reason. Um, so this is a, this is a real, um, testament to her failures as a, as a epic doxer. Um, then, uh, someone PP, Poo Poo PP 420, who has to be a fan of my show. I'm pretty sure that Poo Poo PP 420 is among us right now. Uh, he asks, why are you not more concerned about regaining custody of your oldest child, child? Serious question. I then asked this uh, in reply, how does a mother lose custody of her children? And that's shocking. I, I've heard this detail before, but I forgot the uh, the what happened. So I, I just asked for a follow-up. Hey, how did you lose custody of your kid? Uh, if I remember correctly, she actually uh, just ran away. Like she left the child with her husband or her boyfriend or whatever, the, the baby daddy. And then just disappeared like she abandoned them so she lost full custody because she just like abandoned the child and didn't contest it if uh, that's what i remember but i don't know if that's i'm pretty sure that's true um, but she takes this in the most retarded way possible she says in reply that isn't a concern of mine i have no risk of custody loss you must have doxed the wrong person so i called this is this is a very low iq thing um, if someone is like like 80 IQ and just very mentally challenged in general, uh, if you ever accuse them of anything that hurts their feelings, they will turn it around on you. You, you notice this a lot with uh, Chris Chan because uh, when people called him naive, it really upset him. So it's always been like a huge uh, insult card that he will pull. He'll just randomly call people naive, and that's because uh, – he, it hurt him and he has like a low IQ. So when he wants to hurt other people, he just applies things that have hurt him to other people. So when I correctly point out that she's failed at her attempt to threaten me by trying to dox my family, who's already doxed, uh, she then says, mm, you failed dox me, stalker child, uh, even though th this information is actually true. But why not answer my questions? It would be best for you to treat me nicely. I see you sent your winged monkeys to fly around me. Trolling me won't make this better for you. Since you won't give me a real response, I'll block you for now. Let me know if you want a dialogue to try and save yourself. I always offer it, but dudes like you never take it. Uh, then bullied her more. I screen capped what I could see. And so Jackie Singh spent her early morning hours filmlacting my family to try and make me feel better. It was like 3 a.m. where she was. Um, when someone pointed out that she lost custody of her children and asked how, she posted this and blocked me. I love crazy people. Uh, the king of incels says the chat log is the chat log of her saying the N-word legit. She keeps hiding it, so I'm inclined to believe it is. Um, I reply saying, yes, Jackie desperately wanted to be a part of the trolling hacking group called GNIA, uh, which is the Gay Neighbor Association of America. She was never allowed in because she's dumb, but she hung out in the IAC like a desperate fangirl saying, and you should try and get attention. Uh, that is true. So she was never allowed in GNAA, which was like a trolling group that did uh, like gray hat hacking just to fuck with people. Um, she was never allowed in because she's a retard, uh, but she hung out in their IRC just saying edgy shit, dropping the in bomb constantly, calling people faggot continuously. Uh, obviously, they just saw her as like a retard fangirl groupie and not like a serious member. Um, so she never got in. But people have been calling her like a member of the GNA for a while. 
and that was upsetting her. So she responded to this and said, uh, finally, he admits it, that I was never a member of GNA. I was just a little curry dingleberry off their taint forever. And I never actually accomplished anything, which I don't know how that's a win, but she takes it as a win. Uh, Joseph Schuster says, it was just months ago this person was featured in Banger the Bar Pod episode as being the cybersecurity episode who was accused by a completely innocent man of being tour swats by um, zero evidence. Now she's out there threatening to dox Josh in a fashion that can be charitably, blah, blah, blah. Jackie gets mad and says, anyone who defends the admin of Kiwi Farms, fuck them, including you. Um, and Patrick Tomlinson justifies responding to every single person with no child, uh, with being a correct the record. Um, there was a funny tweet too, in response to this, where, uh, she said something, she, she would, I, I believe that Jackie was actually like a cybersecurity advisor to the Biden campaign. So if you want to know the quality of person that the government will hire and put into positions of power and why everything is so fucked up, they will take a ugly, dumpy Indian woman who is retarded and obviously disturbed. And they will make her a cybersecurity advisor to the presidential candidate for the United States of America. That is the situation that we're in. That's why nothing gets better. Thank you for watching this clip. This is the CACA Lofa. Remember to like and subscribe.